Okay, so Raziel has... Uh, it's back in Vordor's mansion. And, well, things are a little bit kind of screwed up here. Vordor has been taken, and he will be executed, and Mobius will die soon after. But, Raziel, even though he is the only person who would appear to have any type of free will in the world, actually. He is gone and, uh, well, he's doing some, uh, not so, not so, not, not evil things. Oh, okay, there we go. He's gone and he's destroyed Cain. Wow. Uh, ripped out the Heart of Darkness and intends to resurrect Yanos Aldrin with him. Now, Cain was pretty adamant that resurrecting Yanos would be a bad thing. But Raziel seems to have enough of being manipulated by Cain or being manipulated by Mobius or anything like that. Although Mobius seems to imply that Raziel is just sort of playing right to his trap. Despite that, Raziel is going on with what he was uh, continuing with what he was trying to do earlier. You're floating underwater or something? Take off that reaver and you, uh, float better. Ew, it's gotta be sewage. <laughs> it's a lot of poop is what it is. Then again, I wouldn't imagine that Vorador took a lot of turds, you know. Was a vampire. Maybe pee a lot. It's all blood pee. Where did you assholes come from? Madness! Time for a blast. Just you, buddy. Feed the reaver. Okay. Ah, fuck these guys. I'm not gonna waste my time fighting every single enemy. Hopefully this door's still unlocked and they didn't mess with the Yanos. Nice camera angle change. That really messed me up. There we go. This relic had come at so high a cost. My blood offering for the answers I sought from this enigmatic corpse. It was the price of my freedom, for which Cain had paid with his life. journeyed so far and forsaken so much only to have it end like this I remember Raziel the heir of prophecy you came for the Reaver, 
just before the Seraphon found me. You've been entombed here for five centuries. Your murderers are long dead. <gasps> five hundred years? And Vorador, also dead. Your bloodline is erased. The age of the vampires is coming to an end. Then we must waste no time. I'm not who you think I am, nor is this a benevolent act. I have questions that apparently you alone can answer. Brazil, there are forces in this world that will strive to deceive you and pervert your destiny. But you must believe your arrival foretells the salvation of the vampire race. Why then would the vampires devise a weapon to consume and imprison their savior? No, that cannot be. While the blade yet exists, I am drawn inexorably toward my doom. It was you who bound me to this fate. Only you can release me. Raziel, you have been misled. You are ordained by prophecy to wield the Reaver. <sighs> And so I do, though not quite as you'd envisioned. Redeemer and destroyer. Is it possible? Did I misread all the signs? It seems your destiny is more labyrinthian than I had imagined. You must trust me, Raziel. We may have very little time. I will convey you to the place where your answers lie. We are within the ancient citadel of the vampire race, long ago defiled and abandoned. This fortress endured through centuries of war against our great enemy. The Hilden? Yes. From this chamber, we witnessed the summoning of the pillars and the banishment of our adversaries from the land. <sighs> this is a dire omen. The binding is in peril. The hour of prophecy is at hand. It's too late. The pillars are already damned. As long as a single one of us stands, there is still hope. The pillars must not remain under human guardianship. They are not competent to serve. Why then did you allow the pillars to fall into human hands? Raziel, there is no time. I want answers. The world can end this instant for all I care. Very well. The Hilden cursed us as they fell afflicting our race with a predatory bloodthirst. But with this transformation came our enemy's true revenge, immortality. They liberated you from the wheel of fate. They imprisoned our souls in this flesh, expelling us from the purifying cycle of death and rebirth. And yet you pass the curse on. It was a necessary evil. Our immortality banished us from God's grace. He turned his sight from us and fell silent. Many took their own lives, unable to bear the separation from our God. Not you, though. Curse or blessing, it is the price we pay to keep the Hilden banished from the land. To sustain the binding, we had to preserve our bloodline. And so we passed the dark gift to the human successors of our fallen guardians. They rebelled, inevitably, refusing the curse and seizing the pillars as their own. And so we come to our present dilemma. While mankind governs the pillars, the binding decays. The Hilden strain against the barriers of their prison, scratching to gain a foothold back into this world. And what does all this mean to me? We stand at the threshold of a new eon, Raziel. And you are the fulcrum upon which our destiny turns. Beneath this room lies our innermost sanctum. The outer chamber has been opened. It appears events are already in motion. This token is the key to the mysteries you seek. I cannot accompany you. You must face this trial alone. If you prevail, you will have your answers. And if I fail the test, 
Then you will not return. Okay, that was something. Resurrected Janos, but uh, well, Raziel's not quite as not quite as accepting of his advice as he may have been in the past. Watching Janos die before, Raziel was driven to crazed revenge. Now he understands that he may not be destined to be the savior of the vampires after all, and even then. He feels like maybe uh, Janos had been manipulating him before, so he wants to sort of distance himself from anybody who might be doing that kind of thing. He's already done so with Cain, did so with Ariel, Mobius, all those people. Where are you coming from? Time the for a blast. I think I went in the wrong direction while fighting those guys. Ah, oh, there are demons in this faction, in this realm. Camera angle is killing me. Hit the stupid thing, jeez. Okay. <laughs> that was irritating. Uh, oh, something to kill. One more. Kill 
chase. Come on, more of these bastards. dead yet. Come on. These guys are lingering on fire for quite a while. Let through. This looks familiar. <laughs> Can't get through here, can you? Oh yeah, you can. 